Sorry for the buffalo tangent. Anytime I hear someone say buffalo, I have to tell the joke because it's my favorite joke. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, oh, you can only practice and it, I need to... I don't understand that one. Okay. George Washington, the father of our love, was a very ugly man. When George was a rich boy, he took his America and chopped down his father's favorite cherry Australian. Boy, said his father, who has chosen my suit? It would be who has chosen. Hmm. Who has chosen my suit? Then he saw George holding a sharp Game Boy in his hand. Father, said George, I cannot tell a lie. I did it with my little notebook. His father smiled and patted little George on the cell phone. You are a very honest buffalo, he said. And someday you may become the first librarian of the United States. <laughs> oh, this one's silly. So this website is interesting. It's taking a real story. Like George Washington chopped down a cherry tree and his father was angry about it. And he said, I cannot tell a lie. I don't really know the story very well, but... That's a story. Yeah, that's why, like, these ones, <laughs> these ones are just taking a real story and they're replacing the words with funnier words. So, <laughs> how would his father know what a president is? That's a great question because there wasn't a president. But, yeah, I guess, I don't know where George Washington was born. I don't know if he was born in America. He might not have even been born here. Virginia? Okay, he was born in America. He might not have even been born here. Virginia? Okay, he was born in America. Yeah, he was born in America. Oh, that's not it. I have some other things to show. All right, that one was funny. Okay, we had a firefighter request. Let's do one more. Firefighters. Okay, a lot of adjectives, plural nouns, nouns, and a number. Okay, lots of adjectives here. <laughs> Are there any adjectives we didn't get to use before? Any adjectives? I think we got them all. Little. Great. Firefighters. 200 IQ. Does everybody have that one? No. Cypher. Sad. Uh oh. Little. Sad. Strong. <laughs> All right, one more adjective. Strong as a buffalo. <laughs> okay, we can do another buffalo. <laughs> buffalo or buffalo as a buffalo. <laughs> Dangerous. Excellent. Okay, now we need a bunch of nouns. Smelly. <laughs> Let's see if we can put that somewhere else. That's a good one. Smelly. Maybe... Maybe maybe we can put danger and smell. Smelly. Then we have both of them. Danger and smelly. Perfect. Alright, a few more nouns. Four more nouns. So now, person, place, or thing, toys. All right, plural noun toys. What else do we have? Liquid. So some nouns, a number, cheese. Are you eating cheese? <laughs> Defeat. That's one. Good. 
Wikipedia. It's remembering what I wrote before. No, not Game Boy. <laughs> Two more nouns and three plural nouns. Victory! Okay! We have victory and defeat! <laughs> okay. One more noun. Mug. Great. A mug. Number. Should we just like type in a Big number. <laughs> okay. Plural nouns. Peaceful. Excellent. So peaceful is a an adjective. An ad an adjective. Peace. Yep, we can say peace. Alright, so twenty twenty and Peace is a noun, so I'm going to put, well, let's see, peace. Can have peace? Peace. So let's put peace here and make mugs here, because peace is uncountable, so we can't make it plural. So we have peace and mugs. Excellent. All right, two more plural nouns. <laughs> Mugs. So, a mug. I have this mug. This is a mug. Ooh. A mug is a cup that has a handle. This is a handle. So, this is a, well, this is a jar. I'm using it as a cup. And this is a mug. Ooh. Okay. Potatoes and strawberries, okay. Awesome. Now a type of liquid. Feet. Oh, too late, I'm sorry. Ew, liquid feet. We can put strawberry juice. How about we have feet and, uh, and strawberry juice. Freedoms. Ooh, that's a good one, too. Uh, yeah, this just says J, 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 <laughs> I think at Urban Outfitters... Oh, I don't... Oh, what is J, J, and I don't know what that is. Oh, I'm so... I'm just 80 years old. Sorry. What is that? I don't know. I'm so sorry. Can I... Can I Google it? Oh, I'm just... I'm just super lame, huh? Expensive stuff? Oh, okay. Very expensive brand. Oh, okay. No. Um, so, Urban Outfitters just had, like, a bunch of mugs with random letters on them. We have a J mug and a B mug and an M mug. <laughs> no. We do not have a very expensive mug. <laughs> Alright. Firefighters! <laughs> When I was 10 years old, my little ambition in life was to be a firefighter. But here I am, nothing but a sad buffalo. <laughs> if I were a firefighter, I'd get to wear a huge red danger. And I could ride on the fire engines that carry 80-foot toys and travel 2,020 miles an hour. When fire engines blow their mugs, all cars have to pull over to the side of the cheese. Fire departments have hook and defeat wagons, as well as pump trucks, which carry strong hoses that pump strawberry juice into burning potatoes. Firefighters have to go into smelly buildings and fight their way through smoke and victory to rescue any feet who may be trapped inside. <laughs> we should all be thankful that our firefighters are on the job 24 hours apiece. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh no, 3.40 a.m. Awesome! Well, thank you. Thanks for coming. Get some sleep. <laughs> Thanks.
<laughs> yes, oh my gosh. So this website, <laughs> yes, oh my gosh. So this website is actually, it's meant for kids. And so they're, you know, the stories are, the stories are appropriate for kids. Redkid.net. Um, yeah, your son, I'm sure he would love them. I love Mad Libs because they are great for kids and adults. Um, oh, there are also the actual Mad Libs. Like, this is just a, um, a website that has them. But the real Mad Libs, they have, um, they have apps. So they don't ha really have anything on the website, but they have, these are their books, and they have apps. Like, they have kids mad libs apps they have diary of a wimpy kid so if your kid likes diary of a wimpy kid and they have what adult ones so you can play adult ones and then just regular family guy mad libs hello kitty mad libs uh diary of a wimpy kid and just regular Yeah, Annie Mad Libs. These are all some books. Yeah, I think these are fun. And they're fun for kids. They're fun for adults. <laughs> yeah, it's a good way to practice your parts of speech, and it's fun. Yay! I talk in Mad Libs. Oh, no! <laughs> oh. <laughs> See more books. Oh, there are so many. Look at all of these books. Whatever you like. Outcast Mad Libs. Like, Finding Dory. Yeah, there's everything. Frozen. RuPaul Mad Libs. Wow, that's crazy. So many. Aw, thank you. Dance Tracks, thanks for following. Welcome. Hello, hello. Workaholics Mad Libs. Dog. Cat. Yeah. So, there are so many different ones. So, right, there are kid ones, but then there are adult ones, too. <laughs> These are funny. Awesome. Cool. That was fun. Alright, I am going to be right back. And...